Let's see. I'm going to... I've got this hole punch here. I'm going to punch a hole in this. There we go. Little, little tiny hole punch. And then I have this little heart charm that I'm going to string onto I want to tie a knot uh, string this on it just needs a little bit of oomph to it. Now, because this card is for a man and because uh, I want to keep it simple, I'm not putting a lot of embellishments on it, which is unusual for me. I usually put tons of embellishments on my cards. I mean, let's see if I can do this. I'm going to tie a bow. You probably cannot see very good what I'm doing. This is probably really terrible YouTube content. <laughs> but I am going to make a bow. There we go. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. These scissors, by the way, are phenomenal. They're Tim Holtz. They're hard to find, but they're they're Tim Holtz and they're um they're self sharpening. I don't know if you can see, but they have little right along here there's little teeth and they it's they stay sharp they stay real sharp so they're real good okay i'm just gonna mount that right there with i've got some mounting tape get out my handy dandy sticky scissors now remember i told you in a previous video these are the scissors i only use these scissors to cut sticky stuff my sticky scissors. This is just 3M uh, I don't even know what it's called. Mounting tape. I cut it a little too long. You know, a lot of people use Stampin' Dimensionals from Stampin' Up. They are too expensive for me. I don't want to spend that kind of money. Um, and here in a second I'll show you. I bought this stuff. Um, I believe it is called um, insulation foam. It's this wide. It's black. It's sticky on this side and then you pull the tape up and it's sticky. It's a very, very sticky. Um, but I, I got three rolls. I can't even pull it apart. <laughs> but I got three rolls. These big, great, giant rolls. This one was full when I got it. Um, for like 10 bucks. It was so cheap compared to doing this route or the Stampin' Dimensional route. So... Um, and I just got it off Amazon and I'll, I'll try and link it below if I can figure out how to do that. I gotta, I want to make it easy for you guys to find the things that I'm using if you want to look for them. So I just took the backing off and I'm sticking it down right here. And there we have a very monochromatic 
love card for my husband for our third anniversary. And I'll, I'll, I'm not going to put anything on the inside because I like to write long, mushy letters. Um, but I am going to stamp it with my signature because that is customary to stamp your signature on anything that you make. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please hit the like button. Uh, please subscribe if you are so inclined. I would love to have you come visit me for my bantering and card making. Um, I am trying to make a card or a video every day, if not every other day. Um, so hopefully I have lots of good content for you. I try not to make them too long. This one's kind of long, but, uh, uh, you know, I want to, I want to get to know you. Please leave a comment in the comments. Um, if you have any questions about some of the things I shared, um, uh, uh, either about my personal life or about the project, it doesn't matter. Um, I'd love to share with you my, um, my life, my thoughts, my, um, my passion for making cards and bringing joy to people through giving them a handmade card. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day.